Here's how you simplify the fraction 60 one hundredths. What we want to do is find another fraction that's equivalent, has the same value as 60 over 100, but that we've simplified it to lowest terms. To do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into both 60 and 100. I know that 10 would go into 60 and 100 evenly. So 60 divided by 10 is 6. 100 divided by 10, that's 10. So we reduced 60 over 100 down to 6 over 10. But these are even numbers. We could reduce this even further. Let's divide both of them by 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 10 divided by 2 is 5. And we get 3 fifths. We can't reduce this any further. So these are equivalent fractions. If you divide 60 by 100, 6 by 10, or 3 by 5, you'll get 0 0.6. It's just that we've reduced 60 over 100 to lowest terms. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.